welcome to another episode of Sony Simplified on the Sony Connect channel. My name is Eric, I'll be your host today. And if you're new to the channel, we like to take the time together to give you simple tips and tricks on all things Sony to get the best out of all your Sony gear. And as always, before we get going, hit the like and subscribe button below to give you notifications on all of our upcoming videos. And when you're done watching this video, be sure to stick around and check out all the other videos we have on the channel. We don't always talk about cameras. We'll talk about televisions, uh, sound bars, wireless speakers, headphones, to get the best out of all your Sony gear. Please use the chat to ask any questions that come to mind as we go through this. And at the end, I'll do my best to answer as many as I can. Have you ever wanted to connect this with your smartphone or tablet? Well, you're in the right place. Today's topic is the Creators app and all the great features this app allows you to do. Now, the Creators app is an app for your smartphone or your tablet. Both Android and Apple are supported. And once you install it on your phone, you establish a Wi-Fi connection with your camera and allows you to see everything that's on your camera on your smartphone or tablet. Here are the things we're going to discuss today. One, what is possible with the Creators app. Two, I'm going to show you how to make a connection with the phone and your uh, camera. And then three, I'll stick around and answer any questions that you may have. Now, before we get started, some of the older Sony cameras are not supported on the Creators app. So to be sure to check the, uh, the list of the cameras below and inside the app during the connection process, it actually lists which cameras are supported. Okay, so you've just downloaded the Creators app. So you just go and hit the app, give it access. Okay, so now you have the option to uh, connect, import image or upload to the cloud. So we definitely wanna connect to the camera. So I'm gonna hit that. And then it says connect to your camera. So on your camera, you're gonna hit the menu and you're gonna scroll down. Some, some menus are different. So you're gonna scroll down to the uh, network and then come over to where it says smartphone connection and then hit enter and you're gonna see that. So now you go back to your, your uh, device and hit next. You want, these are the cameras that are uh, compatible with your creator's app. Um, for this demonstration, I have a ZV-E1. So I'm gonna press that, prepare my smartphone, allow while using, allow, and then it says ZV-1 in the pairing. I wanna hit that again, and then it's gonna start the pairing process. And it showed up, device name, my Xperia Pro 1. I'm gonna hit okay. Uh, you have the options of 2.4 gigahertz or five. I keep it at five, it's recommended, it gives you the best connection. And so there, now I'm there. So it shows uh, all the options, it shows my camera. I'm connected via Bluetooth. It has uh, my battery life. And then you have the option of what you want to do. Uh, so if I want to do remote shooting, all I do is I press that. It's gonna give you the option. For this, again, for this demonstration, I'm gonna use the Wi-Fi connection, so I don't have to worry about any cables, because if you're out in the field, that's probably the one that you're gonna use the most. And then it's gonna connect, it's gonna search for the device. And yes, I wanna use a temp, that's the Wi-Fi connection. And now I'm connected. So now uh, I can manipulate the camera and whatever I'm showing on the camera, I'm seeing on the device. And then on the device, you have the option, um, I can go to the different shooting modes. So if I wanna go to uh, aperture or manual, I can do that. Uh, if I hit the menu, then it gives you all the, also the controls I can, I can do. So I can do this on the fly. Again, you don't, you don't have to be behind the camera to be able to, to change all these. Lots of options. Uh, I'm out there. Now I want to say I want to, let's see, I want to take a picture. So I've got to put it into just picture mode. And I'm going to take a picture of that. And boop. Then it took the picture. So if I want to do video, I'm uh, back over here. Hit the red button, it's recording. And then I'm good to go. It's that simple. 
Whether it's being able to monitor for composition, transfer photos or videos from your camera to your smart device, or use your phone as a remote control to control the camera when you're not behind it. These are just some of the things that the Creators app allows you to do. And I'll even give you another example. I'm actually using the Creators app right now to do this video. I've made the connection and I can start and stop without having somebody to monitor the camera. Pretty, pretty cool. You can even update the camera's software. You can perform software updates for the, for the supported cameras through a smartphone without even using a PC. As you just saw, the creators, that process is very simple and intuitive. <clears throat> Excuse me. After that first connection, your phone will remember your Wi-Fi settings. All you have to do is power on your camera, launch the app on your phone, and the link is established automatically. Let's check the chat and see if we got any questions out there. Uh, yes, Flex, we hope you had the volume was good enough today. Uh, Jordan, is the app free? Yeah, actually, great question. Yes, the app is 100% free both on the Android and the Apple platform. And uh, Quase, uh, well, if have any other questions you got, uh, please pop it in there. And as a few reminders, please check out all the, the other uh, videos we have on the Sony Connect channel. Um, and if you have any other suggestions, please pop it in the chat. We'll try to get those out to you as well. Please register all your Sony products to get easier access to support and notifications on all future uh, videos. And again, we monitor the chat even after the video is over. So if you have uh, hit us up on topics you want to see on future videos, hit that like and subscribe button below for access. And before I close, uh, I want to thank my producer, Anthony, my editor ever uh, for all the help behind the scenes, putting this video together. Uh, we appreciate you spending a little bit of your day with us today in the creators app. Have a great week and I'll see you next time.